Hey, excuse me over there. I don't need a disclaimer. This is my channel. Argue with your pets. If you don't have one, maybe argue with your best friend. If you don't have that either, hmm, I can't help you. All opinions are mine, and that's that. <laughs> Hey guys, it's the Delphinator here and this is Top 5. So, I was initially supposed to put out the video Top 5 Throwback Bollywood Films, but guess what? My shootist and I can't find the hard drive where the footage is. Ugh. So, I decided to do something else. Shout out to my friend Abiola Basharan for giving me the idea. Summer movies. Go check out her social media page, guys, at Abiola Nurtures. She's doing great humanitarian work. Can I get a drum roll for her, please? <laughs> okay, let's talk about the movies I'm looking forward to the most this summer. Lego. At number five, The Dark Tower. It's a Idris Elba, yo. Don't lie, ladies. Why else do you want to watch this film? I'm not even like you guys. Can't be watching film because of Mani Loon. Lawless. <laughs> <laughs> on the real though i saw this trailer and i was like what this is a cinema something not laptop -o. the dark tower is a fantasy sci-fi movie with story originally by stephen king it was directed by nikolai arcel and stars idris elba duh matthew mcconaughey Catherine winnick of the vikings and others coming in at number four transformers the last night robot dementia don't know about the last installment but i shall still be watching this because Michael Bay. I saw this really cool video on IG about how Michael Bay shoots live action in 3D like nobody else. Bomb stuff. I'm still not sure how I feel about Mark Wahlberg as the lead in the Transformers franchise. Don't get me wrong, I love him as an actor, but I just feel Shia LaBeouf sold the lead character better. Where is that one safe? Baba dropped Transformers and now Hollywood has dropped his life. This cabal something safe is not even fair. One needs to be very prayerful in this Hollywood. You gotta perpetually have tongues of fire on your head to prosper on these mean streets, man. <laughs> At number three, Baby Driver. Y'all remember Anselm Elgert, right? The kid from from the fault in our stars that really sad morbid and poetically depressing film ah uh, i still loved it though <laughs> well ansel elgart plays baby in this movie okay just by the way did y'all know little dude could sing look I know, right? Baby Driver is an action comedy movie directed by Edgar Wright. Same guy who gave us Shaun of the Dead, Hot Fuzz, and Scott Pilgrim. So you can imagine how excited I am to see this. It stars Kevin Spacey, Jamie Foxx, John Hamm, Lily James, and others. Coming in at number two, Atomic Blonde. Y'all should know by now that in my mind, somewhere in the left corner of my right ventricle, Charlize Theron is my older sister. Atomic Bay! <laughs> I don't even joke around with this babe. She can do no wrong in my eyes. Well, except when she's dressing her son in girly clothes not cute so i saw this trailer and i could not sit still i believe it's written somewhere in the stars that i must feature in a hollywood action film before i die it must happen in this life no devil is stopping me atomic blonde is a spy action film directed by david lich and stars charlize theron of course james mcavoy sophia butella our auntie from the mummy john goodman and others and at number one drum rolls please Spider-Man Homecoming. I am most excited about this. Did y'all see that DJ Khaled promo video? Best. <laughs> I posted this on my IG the other day at the Delphinator TV. Go check it out. So this movie, Tony Stark gives Peter Parker his Spidey suits and we could say that they have this mentor-mentee relationship. The banter in this movie is gonna be ace going by the trailer alone. It was directed by John Watts and obviously Robert Downey Jr. reprises his role as Iron Man. The new kid on the block, Tom Holland and plays teenage spidey and i hear zendaya plays quite the mysterious character Ooh, <laughs> i'm looking forward we'll see if you're interested i've linked the trailers to the five movies mentioned in the description box below are there any other summer movies you're looking forward to please tell me about them in the comment section below this was fun to write record and edit once again it's the delphinator here always great hanging with you guys do not forget to subscribe hit the thumbs up button and share until the next one toodles